so many changes this year, and children are not immune to the feelings of stress, anxiety, and depression. So mom and budding author in South Jersey is helping kids deal with their feelings in a quietly creative way through meditation. NBC10 South Jersey Bureau reporter Sydney Long reports from Mullicle Hill to show us how. On a Thursday morning in her Mullica Hill meditation studio. Rub your hands together and make some energy until it's nice and warm. Thajal Patel is taking time out to teach. Feel our mind and is it fast or is it slow? That kids even under the age of six can meditate. We brush our teeth to keep the sugar bugs away. We wash our body to keep the germs away. And it's not too far of a reach to teach our children. We brush our brain by meditating and taking deep breaths every day. The former preschool owner and divorce attorney stepped away from her stressful career to focus on mindfulness. Her book, Meditation for Kids, was published in April, a date chosen before the pandemic hit. But with stress, uncertainty, or anxious feelings kids face about remote or hybrid school, First, you say Chris Cross. the art of sitting still and breathing playfully, she prays, will gain momentum. When you're feeling anxious and nervous and your mind feels like a howling hurricane wind, how do you make it feel like a starry, quiet summer night? And we're going to do windy windmill breath. Then you take your sunglasses. Even her six-year-old, Ayan, can guide the class. According to the CDC, there are behaviors that indicate your child is feeling stress or anxiety, excessive crying, returning to behaviors they've outgrown, worry or sadness, not eating or sleeping well, and acting out. When you're feeling angry and hot, like there's lava rocks on your chest, we're going to do sipping strawberry smoothie breath. Local families are now booking classes and Parents Magazine plans to feature Thajal's creative and fun calming breath lessons this month too. We're planting these seeds at such a small age that they're going to be able to handle any challenge pandemic style or even someone cutting them off and traffic. They'll be able to handle it. One more deep fall breath in. Reporting from Mullica Hill. And a deep breath out. Sydney Long. NBC 10 News.